This is CNN Heroes. There's no money to eat. It's hard to find a job. I live on the street. When you're hungry, you're hungry, that's it. Four years ago, I see those guys standing out like they're desperate. They need to eat. My name is Jorge Munoz, and every night I bring food to the hungries of Queens, New York. <laughs> I'm born in Colombia, but I'm a citizen right now. I'm a school bus driver. When I come back around 5.15, my second job started. Prepare the milk, pack him up. It's like a family project, seven days a week. I go to uh, 10 corners every night and around 9.30. They're waiting for me. ¿Cómo ha estado? ¿Bien? The economy is real bad right now. Day by day, the number increased. Two months ago, it was 100, now it's jumped to 140. It's a lot. So he's awesome. I mean, he, they call him the angel of Queens. For intermediate it's through him that many of us are fed. In the beginning, it was just Hispanics. But now I see different nationalities. I help anyone who needs to eat, just line up. ¿Qué más, hombre? ¿Cómo estás? ¿Qué ¿Qué más? ¿Listo, hombre? The best part is when you see this man. I want them to eat every night. For me, it's easy. Compare with them, I'm rich. Pretty good. Tired, but good. Tell us about your hero at cnn.com slash heroes. My mom, since my childhood, teach me to cheer. That's the main thing. Since I was like six years old, she teach me to cheer my toys, my whatever I have extra. So that's when you see these guys and I have that food right there. I think for me it's easy. Maybe for other people not, but for my mom, my sister and me, I think it's easy, easiest way to help somebody. We try to use every empty space we have in the house. We had to use it as storage. Okay, this is the dining room, and then no dining room around. This is the table. We got some few donations today, like uh, uh, trays of pineapple, pancakes, waffles, some kind of chicken. We got four baskets of milk. Being donated to, we got muffins back here, and we got another a box of cornflakes. It's not a house anymore, it's a storage right now. For me, it's okay, my mom is the one, she always told me, George, I need my house back. But she's not, you know, she's not complaining, she's happy. People donate money, but now, because of the economy, people has no money to donate, so I'm using part of my salary, my mom and my sister can help me out. Well, we're spending it in four weeks. It's like four hundred, four hundred and fifty dollars, and my weekly paycheck is like six fifty, seven hundred dollars. My mom is my hero. Why? Because she's sixty-eight. She's supposed to retire and watch TV, but when it came to her, like four years ago, and I, mommy, I got these people. I got this food. What you just prepare twenty meals, and she says, "Okay, let's do it." So I think for me, she's a hero. I have a stable job, I got my mom, my family, I got a house, everything I wanted I have. And this guy not. So I just thinking about okay, I have okay. a food. At least for today they're gonna have a, a meal to eat. Tell us about your hero at CNN.com slash heroes.